The following video is made for entertainment and comedic purposes only. The voices in this video are not authorized by the actual voices in IRL. Please enjoy the video. All right, Joe. We're sorry for leaving you out on the last game we played. An actual apology from the annoying orange? Wow, I never thought I would see it coming. But are you really sorry for me? Not really. Oh, come on, Donald. Give him a break. Yeah, even though I'm new here, I can understand how he feels. Yeah, Joe, we feel really bad, even Donald. He just won't accept it. All right, fine. It wasn't the same without you, Sleepy Joe, and I mean it. I guess I can take that as an apology. But in return, you have to let me pick the next game we play after this. All right, fine. We can do that. All right, with that being said, what's on the agenda for tonight, boys? Well, I have an idea. I just don't know how you guys will react. Joe, I swear to God, if this is another one of your childish puzzle games, I might actually lose it. It's not even close to a puzzle game. No fucking way. You're kidding me. Oh, hell yeah. I can't believe it. One of the best games in history. How the hell did you get a Nintendo Wii Joe? I actually had this one since it first came out. I haven't played it since I first became your VP, Barry. Okay, now I'm getting excited. Now you know this is going to be a blast from the past. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's hop in this bitch. Okay, to start this off, how about we play the most American sport ever? And that would be? Baseball. Oh, hell yeah. Nothing beats a game of baseball while drinking a beer on the sidelines. Just watch out, boys. I'll be hitting dingers everywhere. I don't know about that one. How about we do a classic battle of Democrats versus Republicans? You really want to get your ass clapped like you did in 2020 when you lost to me? You mean Kamala Harris beat me, not you. Hey guys, come on, none of that political sh**. How about we do just a classic game where the teams are random? If that's the case, since it's only made for two people, we can take turns. I'm cool with that. As long as we can agree, let's get started. All right, gentlemen, it's time to get our game on. More like getting shit on Barack. Once we're through with you, my team will be the victors. Guys, no petty squabbling during this game. Remember, we're here to have fun. Let's just give it our all. Let's take a look at the teams for this match. There's a hamburger on my team. Looks like I'm with Don. Wow, me and Iron Man on the same team. I guess I'm with the Republicans. You mean the winners? In your dreams, you're going down, Fat Orange. Oh, now it's on. And it looks like Barry is going first. Let's see what he's got. Seems that Mickey Mouse couldn't catch a grip onto the ball and leaving Barry with a single. No worries, he won't be getting a point this inning. We'll just see about that. Next up is Judy and she looks like she's ready to break an egg. More like break a leg after this fastball. Damn it. And that's one strike for Judy. Time for another one. She's got this. Oh God damn it. And it looks like a home run for Team Barry. Hell yeah, Judy, what a swing. Now that's unfortunate for us having the score two to zero. This game will be over before you know it. Trying to get cocky there, huh, Bill? Hey, if the shoe they threw at you fits. All right, next up to bat, we have Cal. Watch this. Hey, Cal, think fast. Oh, what the hell? Haha, <laughs> nice try, buddy. Donald acting like a 14-year-old intimidating his opponents. And so far, the plan is working. Uh, wait, why is the screen frozen? I think our PC is shitting itself since we're recording the game on OBS. For those of you who are watching, we do apologize since this is our first time connecting the Wii to our PC. So please bear with us if this ever happens. And there it goes again. What's even happening right now? Triple. What? I call bullshit on that. I don't know what happened, but thank God we survived. This game is rigged. You can't cheat in Wii Sports, Don? Now shut up, it's my turn to play. How about your turn to eat this fastball? Sorry, but I don't swing that way, unlike Barry. What the f Bill? Oh, come on, George, why didn't you dive for it? Joe, you know my old ass can't move that fast. Oh, sh now we got Tony Stark up in here. Watch me psych him out. Joe, did you just fall asleep after that pitch? I don't know what that was, sorry guys. And this is what happens when you elect someone with dementia as president. Joe, I just noticed that you got a new mic, it sounds clean. Thank you for noticing, Barry. Hunter completely destroyed my blue Yeti, so I had to buy a brand new one. Wow, Joe Biden buying something important for once instead of his dumb ice cream? Donald, just because I love my chocolate chocolate chip doesn't mean you have to be such a dick about it. Yeah, and let's not forget the part where you ordered over 300 cheeseburgers from McDonald's for the White House. Oh, shut up. At least I make the right choices. Highly unlikely. Haha, <laughs> suck on that, TJ. Get out of here. My God, show some respect for TJ trying Trump. Speaking of McDonald's, I think I found Donnie's lover. Oh, no. Why do I have to face off against my most trusted companion? He's not serious, right? 
It's best if we don't question it, Barack. Let's just focus on this game. It kind of looks like we're running a marathon with all these bats. Either that or they're falling asleep like you, Joe. Hey! I'm just saying. So far, so good. All right, let's try this again. I won't let you get another point, Hussein. I hate it when you call me that. Give it another try, Barry. There we go. No luck for you this time. God damn it. Oh, finally. I thought that inning would never end. And now it's our turn to play. And would you look at that? The annoying orange is up first. Hey, fat ass, eat this. Damn it, Barack. You throw like a girl. Would a girl throw a splitter? Oh, my God. Donald seems to be annoyed. What gave it away? Oh, thank God. I thought I was going to have a stroke. Aren't you bound to have one? Says the guy who looks like a used tampon. Gross. Gross. All right, Tessa, show us what you got. I'll mop the floor with her. What the hell? That wasn't a foul ball? Nope, it landed inside the field first, then rolled over the out of bounds. Now this, I can admit, is not fake news. Oh, sure, like, we're not gonna mention the fact that you promised Kim Jong-un that if you win the election, you would freeze the making of nuclear bombs in Korea? Hey, Kim is a really nice guy. He just made a deal that I couldn't refuse. Donald, I swear to God, it better not have anything to do with McDonald's. The silence speaks for itself. Um, I plead the fifth. You're such a fat ass. The only president with an IQ of a mole rat. And the looks of a pit bull. Both of you. Oh, hey, it's my turn to play. Sorry, Joe, we may be in the same party, but I'm kicking your ass. After that dive your team made, I'll be walking it off with pizzazz. Joe, do you even know what pizzazz means? Yeah, I know, it's a type of topping on a pizza. And this is our president? My God, the dementia is too critical to comprehend. Come on, Mickey, show them how it's done like when you walk down Main Street. Seriously, Joe? This is just embarrassing. And I thought I was bad enough. You still are. All right, come on, Jared, time to start hitting those bases. Yoink! Barack, what the hell was that? Did you pop a blood vessel? Sorry, I was trying to sneeze, and it didn't come out at the right time. I hope you didn't sneeze on the controller. Otherwise, you're playing by yourself from now on. That's right, Jared. Nice home run. Oh, come on. That was supposed to be another strike. Now this game is getting interesting. And that's three more points for the Trumps. Donald, we are not calling our team name after you. Can we please just get back to the game, you two? It's now my time to shine. And my time to grind this pitch. Not a bad hit there, George. Didn't know you had that much power in you. I know a thing or two. Back when I was a kid, I would always play baseball in the little leagues. I can say the same thing. Back then, I was only focused on playing baseball with my brother. I didn't know you had a brother. I do. I love him very much. I just don't talk about him. I can respect that. And that's it for the first inning of the game. On to round two. Oh, and here comes Judy up to the plate once again. I'll get her this time. I'm guessing my fastballs are too hot to handle. And now here comes the cocky son of a bitch that is Donald J. Trump, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, Judy, hit another home run. Okay, Donald, what are you trying to do here? Just my usual strategy, making my opponent swing before I throw it. I'm just amazed that Judy is still able to hit the foul balls and is still being able to focus. Joe, you do realize that we're the ones doing all of that, right? Doing all of what? Jesus, Joe, did you take your dementia pills today? I might have forgotten them. Let me call Kamala and see if I can get her to bring me some. Why ask her when you have Secret Service agents? I trust her more than my agents. Let me call her real quick. This ought to be good. Hello, this is future female President Harris speaking. Damn it. Hey, Kamala, it's Joe. Can you bring me a bottle of dementia pills to the Oval Office? Joe, I'm in a meeting discussing women's rights. I don't have time to help you. I'll let you fly, Air Force One. God damn, she didn't even hesitate to answer. She's like a dog begging for a treat at the dinner table. Weird way of putting it there, Trump. On the other hand, we're still winning by a landslide. Yeah, go ahead and enjoy it, because the next time we bat, we'll be the ones in the lead. And it looks like Todd is ready for some redemption. And his redemption is a success. Oh, come on, guys. It's not that hard to just do a little cardio. Said's the guy who looks like Jabba the Hutt after eating 10 Big Macs a day. I'm sorry, but this is not the president you are looking for. Okay, since when did this involve Star Wars? Looks like TJ is trying to get revenge on you, Don. He ain't gonna do shit. I'll send him packing all the way back home. What the hell? I didn't know Mies can jump like that. There's a lot of things we don't know. 
And just like that, we're now up to bat again. Okay, Alex, let's show these fools how to make America great again. More like make America fall again. Son of a bitch. At least he tried, Donald. Do I have to do everything around here? Unfortunately. What the fuck? That was unexpected. Want to talk shit to me again? Not really. I just got to respect that one. That's what I thought. It's still anyone's game here, fellas. We still have another inning and a half left to go. All right, Tessa, show us what you got. I'll send her to the bleachers. Now that's a perfect hit. You sure about that? What do you mean by that? Oh, I see now. All right, Jack, no fooling around this time. This will be an easy out. Just like I said, too easy. Barack, I'm about this close from smacking you in the face like Will Smith at a comedy show. Bitch, I know you won't do it. Oh God, the Big Mac himself is back. Just try not to eat him. I mean, I might have to make a quick pit stop at McDonald's after this. I'm not even gonna say anything. How about we change the subject? Did you guys hear that DeSantis dropped out of the campaigning for president? I'm not surprised. He never stood a chance in the first place. But there's one candidate that I was surprised to see running. You must be talking about Nikki Haley, right? That's the one. Wait, isn't she the former governor of South Carolina? She is, and I hear she's doing a pretty good job at it. I just can't wait to get back into the White House and make America great again. Don, you got outclassed by Sleepy Joe. What makes you think you can run another four years in office? Well, I have three reasons. One, the Republican Party will always have my back. Two, I helped create millions of new jobs for our country. Holy shit, Dalton just hitting out of the park. And three, I have a smoking hot wife, Melania. I mean, he's not wrong about Melania being smoking. Yeah, but that has nothing to do with you getting back into office. And people still call me the world's greatest president. Damn it, Donald. How are you so good at throwing fast balls? Strike. And how is that a strike? It's just in the flick of the wrist. Now I'm just getting irritated. Someone woke up on the wrong side of the bed today. Strike. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Jesus, Barry, it's just a game. A game where I'm losing to the fattest president in history. Sorry, but that title belongs to William Howard Taft. I know it'll cheer you up, Barry. Anyone up for some Red Lobster after this game? That'll make me feel better. I'll even buy dinner for all of us. Wow, Towers, you really are stepping up in the world, aren't you? Donald, call me Towers again and I won't pay for your food. Oh, fine, I'll stop. McDonald's will have to wait then. For once, you're not getting McDonald's? Go eat your damn ice cream, Joe. Now back to the game. And it looks like Team Barack is still winning against Team Donald by three points. Here's a fastball, Bill. Damn it, my reaction time is really shit. It's not like the good old days. All right, Joe, here are your pills. Now, where are those damn plane keys? They're in the desk on the left-hand side next to the ice cream button. When I get back in office, I am going to remove that and put my Diet Coke button back. That is if you win the next election. Joe, how the hell are you gonna let Kamala fly Air Force One? I'm not. She'll believe anything she hears. I'll have to deal with her later. Those are my locker keys I had from high school. She won't get far. Joe, you crazy son of a bitch. I think you deserve an extra side of chocolate chocolate chip for dessert, Joey. And look at that. Todd is back for one more swing to victory. Psych! Really, Donald, quit acting like a child. Anything to get you guys to lose. And that's it for you guys. Comeback season starts now. It's all right. As long as we can prevent you from getting a point, this game is ours for the taking. Time for the world's best baseball player to take the stand. Joe, you call that your best? Even Jackie Robinson would be disappointed. Hey, there's no need to bring up the legend of baseball himself. He'd respect anyone who tried at least. Barack, I swear you're only saying that giving your complexion. The fuck did you just say? But I will respect him for uniting our beautiful nation with his beliefs. I can't tell if that's a compliment or an insult. This guy deserves to be in prison. Don't forget that I was the one who gave him the Congressional Gold Medal back in 2005. So much for no petty squabbling, huh, George? Nice job, Mickey. Let's keep that momentum going. Come on, Barry, show this pumpkin what a two-term president can do. I'll be more than happy to. And now Jared is back up to bat. Can he bring another one home? No, he cannot. Not to worry. We still have a chance for a comeback. Give him your all, George. Curve shot! My God, he's like a walking cannon about ready to blow. Oh, trust me, I'm just warming up. There is no way that Todd missed that play. 
Not too shabby. We still have to stand on our toes if we're going to win this. I just now noticed that we have a human-sized dog on our team. This is definitely some family guy bullshit. Whether if it is or not, he just gave us two more points. Maybe I was right at the beginning. Our team is falling asleep. Don't give up just yet, Barry. We still need to get two more outs for the game. Not if we have anything to say about it. Oh, okay, it's just Alex. We'll be safe for now. Don't you know the saying, don't judge a book by its cover? Oh, son of a bitch. And just like that, we are now tied up. There's not much of a choice, Barry. We need to end this game with a tie. As long as we keep throwing fastballs, we'll have a chance. Thankfully, yours truly is about ready to start hitting dingers. Okay, that was just a practice swing. Yeet! Obama, what the fuck was that? A distraction. Almost got him with that one. Just give up, Don. You're not winning this. I'm not giving up that easily. Spoken like a true politician. Now that's an out. Oh, what the fuck? And Donald Trump gets lucky once again, ladies and gentlemen. There's no way that just happened. Again. Oh, buddy, it happened. And it's going to stay that way. You were saying, Donald? Crap. And now to end this game with a draw. Oh, Jack, please get a single at least. No! Yes, that's what I'm talking about. I knew we could do it, guys. Wow, that was such a close game. Donald, you just got lucky. But yeah, that was a close one. At least you're showing some sportsmanship, Barry. Oh yeah, look at that handsome fella right there, winning the game for us. Donald, we all stepped up to the plate. Give us some credit at least. Other than that, Joe, you did an outstanding job picking this game. Don't forget that I'm picking the next game too. You said I could at the beginning. Anyways, are you guys ready for Red Lobster? Hell yeah, man, I'm starving. When are you not hungry? All right, let's head out. Let me run to the bathroom first. Give me like five minutes. I have a feeling it's gonna be more than five. It's pretty obvious. We all know he's gonna pass out on the toilet.